Hey guys, um, so I decided to make this video because I haven't made a video in a really long time about my braces. Um, so this is probably like the fourth time I go to the dentist or fifth time that I go to the dentist. Um, and this is what my teeth look like at the moment. This tooth, they still haven't like attached it with the rest of the teeth or whatever. Um, and I can't wait. I hope that they do that today. He just keeps saying like, oh, we're still going to be making space for that tooth. We're still going to be making space for that tooth. And I'm like, all right, whatever. You know, as long as it takes. I just want that tooth to be up and running, you know? Um, but I have seen a bit of an improvement. Um, well, not ever, not since I... This is the tooth that I seen the most most improvement with, um, because this was the one that was um, very very crooked. Uh, it was basically these two, so this one's starting to straighten out, and then this one's still like left behind, um, because like I said, um, they're trying to make room for it. Um, so yeah, and I can't wait for that. The one thing that I have noticed about my teeth is I started getting this gap right here. I'm not sure why. I don't know if it's because my teeth are moving, or or what, but. Um, yeah, that's probably what I'm going to ask him today. Like, what's up with this gap? Like, is it going to close or what? Because I didn't have that before. Um, I do know that my bottom teeth were a little bit crooked. Not, like, you can't, you can't even notice it. But um, if you look at them closely, you, you were able to notice a bit of a, you know, crooked. So maybe that's why I have this gap. Maybe they, they are straightening out. Um, from the looks of it, it looks like they are. Um... So yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, I got my root canals done in Mexico. Um, I'm still in the process of getting one done. I'm almost done. Um, it's just more of a longer process because I'm going to Mexico rather than just doing it here and like it only taking an hour or something. Um, and the reason why I'm going all the way over there is because it's way cheaper. <laughs> um, unfortunately, my insurance didn't cover uh, root canals or whatever I think they said they cover the work but they, they don't cover the actual crown and the actual crown was like around $800 um, and I needed three I know I know um, so um, yeah so I just went to Mexico and I got it for way cheap it's still the same work still good dentists and um, yeah um, like I said it's just a longer process um, but I did get my crown it's all the way back here, I can't, it's this one right here. So now that I have to, the dentist, or the orthodontist has to reattach my braces because I did have to take my, that bracket out. Um, and for a tooth back here as well. Um, but I haven't gotten to that one, so I'm going to have to tell him, you know what, he didn't get to work on this one. Just because I've been very busy, I wasn't able to keep going over there. Um, let me turn the TV off because I had it on, I was watching a movie, Cape Fear. If you haven't seen Cape Fear with Robert De Niro, it's really great. Um, but anyway, um, um, so yeah, I hope he's just not like, oh my god, you know. I don't think there's nothing completely wrong with um, waiting. It's just, um, I'm going to have my braces on for a little bit longer. I think that's the only reason um, why he would say something. But <sighs> whatever, I mean, I have to fix my teeth, right? Um so yeah, I can't wait. Another thing, I don't know if it's like, if this happens with you guys, I just get so, um, how do you say it? I get so um, self-conscious um, when I go to the dentist and he's like looking at my teeth because I mean, come on, I don't have the whitest teeth ever. I have like cavities and all of that. Um, I mean, I don't have cavities now, but um, I have like, the gray stuff and it's like oh my god every time i'm just laying there he's probably like damn this, this girl's mouth has just been like i don't even know like it's just embarrassing you know and he doesn't really say he doesn't say anything but he's probably thinking it i don't know but um yeah that's pretty much it um i have no idea what he's gonna tell me today i haven't i hope that this tooth um i hope that he finally put a bracket on that tooth or whatever just to get the process going but I have a feeling that he's not and um I'm just gonna ask him like how much longer do you think it's gonna take and I hope that my tooth my very last one not having a bracket on it because of the root canal I hope that's not the reason why it's gonna take longer 
um, or what, you know, I have no idea. And the, 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 also, sorry, having braces makes me like not be able to pronounce words and I hate it, you know, cause that's something I had noticed with people with braces before, like the way that they say their S's and that the way, they, the way they, that, that they talk. And now I understand why, like braces do change the way that you talk, you know, because you have something on your teeth. So, um, yeah. It gets very, very frustrating and I hate it, but yeah, I don't know if this is a thing like where I try to practice how to talk with braces. I know that sounds so ridiculous, but I'm like, okay, how can I talk without, let me close the windows, let me just cut in the grass. I'm like, how can I talk or learn how to talk like without, you know, lisping, <laughs> lisping or whatever. And it's hard, but um, now I understand why. And it's just something that you have to live with while you have braces. Um, I mean, it's not that much a big of a deal, but still. Um, so yeah, I wonder what he's gonna tell me today. I'm gonna go ahead and brush my teeth and everything. Um, that way, I mean, brushing my teeth before, dent before the dentist is something you should do, at least me that have braces. I just recently ate, so I'm definitely gonna brush my teeth. Um, and it does make me feel a little bit less self-conscious about what he sees inside of my mouth because I honestly think this is the worst mouth, he, mouth he's looked into like seriously maybe there's worse people like there's worse things that he's seen but you know just me being me I'm always thinking like oh my god this is horrible and embarrassing but yeah so um yeah I wonder what he's gonna say I hope that I get good news I hope that he doesn't feel like I hope he's not like great now you have to wait for another freaking month because I'm not gonna be here next week um so um I don't even know I'm gonna go back to Mexico I'm gonna finish everything like in June like the the first week of June and then after that I hope is when I get my appointment because um that's when I'm gonna have everything fixed um and that's another thing when I go to the dentist and stuff and the orthodontist is asking me like, oh, well, do you know the exact date? And I do. And it's just at the moment I forget everything I want to ask him. I forget everything that I know. I don't know why the hell this happens to me. It happens to me everywhere. I, my mind just goes blank. I have no idea. It's like I'm putting like as I'm testifying on something and I'm just like, um, not that I have. But yeah, I, I'll see what he says. And um, yeah. And as far as my colors, I always just go with pearl. Um, I don't think I'm ever going to be open to trying a color like red or pink or whatever. I'm just not interested in that. I'm just going to keep it simple um, with my pearl. And yeah, see how that goes. So I'll let you guys know what happens after I am um, out of the orthodontist and see. Just keep you guys updated if you guys are interested for some reason. Uh, I'm trying to think what else. I can say, um, as far as pain, I don't feel pain anymore. It doesn't hurt. Um, it's just the way that I talk now. Like that's the only thing that bothers me is my speech sometimes. But other than that, um, yeah, it doesn't hurt. Nothing. Um, when they do change the, this, um, I do feel my teeth. I kind of like relax, you know, and you just feel like, oh, it feels great. Like when something's just been really tight and then you let it go and it just, you feel comfortable, you know, I, I can't really come up with the words right now, but that's how I feel when they take this off, the whatever. And then when they put a new one, then you feel your teeth tightening up again. Um, and it kind of feels good. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. But um, yeah, I'll keep you guys updated once I'm out of the orthodontist. And yeah, I'll see you guys later. Okay, you guys. So I just got back from the dentist. I wasn't able to like film over there or whatever. Um, but I got my braces again. As you can see, I got my pearl bands or whatever and of course you can see because they are wetter than my teeth <laughs> um but yeah uh for my new uh the tooth this one i thought that we're gonna add a, a bracket to it or whatever um to keep the process going just since i do have the teeth but he decided to um leave it um by itself for now he just added like this coil or whatever it's called um and then until my other tooth is already done and, and fixed or whatever, um, then he's going to add the, the, these things. Um, 
as far as the gap it is because my teeth are moving so um yeah he's like yeah that's totally gonna close really fast once um everything is um you know straight or whatever um so yeah that was basically it um it was pretty fast and yeah i just told him like i cannot wait for this tooth to actually be already you know up and running or whatever and he's like yeah i know he's like uh, the good news is that he does see more space, which is what he's trying to do is um, make more space. That way he can add that tooth to, to the rest of my teeth. Uh, he's like, maybe like in two visits we'll be able to, to do it. So I'm excited for that. I'm really, really excited uh, to finally be able to to have it, you know, and, and um, have my teeth look great. It's... I'm, I'm happy. I'm happy. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, I did notice that I drink a lot of coffee. Um, I don't really, I don't drink soda. Um, I rarely drink soda and that's sometimes when we go out to eat. Um, but I rarely go out for soda, but I do drink a lot of coffee and, and that's something that worries me because I know that it, yeah, it stains your it stains your teeth, and when I get my braces off, I'm probably gonna have that uh, you know, that scarring or whatever it's called. Um, but um, like I said, I did I was thinking of um whitening my teeth. It's something that I am gonna do like for sure. Um, but I mean that doesn't give me an excuse to keep drinking coffee and like oh it's fine. I don't care how yellow my teeth get. You know what I mean? Like. It's something that uh, that does worry me, but it's so hard. I mean, who can stop drinking coffee for real? Like, I love coffee. I love me some iced coffee. I love me some hot coffee at night, coffee in the morning. Like, I love my coffee. Um, so I honestly don't think I'm going to stop drinking coffee. Like, you know? Um, but, yeah, that's my little update um, this time. Um... I believe this was my fourth visit. I'm not sure if it was my fourth or fifth. Um, but I mean, hey, my teeth have been... I saw a big improvement right away. Like, if you see my first video, um, you can see how crooked my tooth was. This one. Like, this one was just, like, coming out. And this one's still the same, um, obviously. But I saw a really big improvement like movement really, really fast. And I was so excited. I was like, oh, my God. Like, my tooth isn't crooked anymore and because my tooth was crooked it would leave like uh like on my tongue it would leave like um imprint on it which I hate it I hate it and you know because every time I would talk I, I would feel like oh my god people can see that it looks gross you know and now I don't I don't get that anymore and I do get a little bit of things because of this tooth it's like a uh, here it's right there <laughs> um but I mean now I don't have that ugly tooth sticking out, which I'm so happy about. Um, so yeah, I guess I'll see you guys in my next visit. Um, like I said, I haven't been updating a lot of my braces videos. Um, but I mean, it's something that I'm, I will continue to do. Um, and yeah, so these are my teeth now. And I cannot wait to keep moving forward. Alright, so I'm leaving because they're going to be bugging me right now. They're knocking on my door. So um, I'll see you guys next time. Alright, bye.